read a quote that you mentioned saying inflation is a little bit like the extra weight, the extra kilos you put on. It, it's easy to put on, but it's very hard to get rid of. Yes, indeed. Uh, so, uh, but now we have it, you know, and it comes from uh, the war in Ukraine, especially, and in France it's a concern, as it is a concern everywhere. So inflation is a bit lower in France due to the intervention of the government. Uh, and uh, since uh, everybody is asking for this intervention, even the opponent, you know, actually, of the actual government, there will be a package. Uh, Especially, there will be a price control. Uh, they want to monitor the increase of the price of electricity and, um, and gas, uh, which is nice, uh, which implies that the inflation is much lower, but it's very costly. You, know, you have to think uh, that this price control costs something like 30 billion euro per year uh, to the uh, French public finance. So it's not, uh, it's not really sustainable, you know. And we had that letter this week from the governor of the Banque de France, uh, Monsieur de Gallo, saying, look, these are short-term solutions, but the only short-term solution is a monetary one, and we need to watch this issue of the debt. We can't keep on living as if the debt wasn't an issue. And is that the case in France? But, but of course, view. it's uh, uh, as in other countries, you know, the, the interest rates were very low, so it was, let's say, on the short term, easy uh, to, uh, to get in debt, you know, for, uh, for state, but it will be much more costly now, so it's not sustainable. I mean, and on the package that was presented yesterday to the cabinet here in France, that will start being debated uh, next week, uh, some say, look, it's for its short-term solution. It's understandable how raising pensions, for example, or raising uh, civil service salaries. But long term, are some of these solutions actually feeding the beast and actually making inflation more endemic? Uh, but in order to deal with that, you know, there is no uh, much other solution than uh, increasing, uh, you know, labor, um, actually, and, uh, and production. And there is a room for improvement in France with uh, the senior uh, worker, you know, those of age uh, 55 to 64, which is, uh, whose participation to the labor market is much lower in France than in uh, a similar country. Huh? You have to think that it's a, it's a, bit, a, bit, a bit above than 50 percent, like uh, one senior worker of uh, two is participating to the labor market. So, uh, so um, it's a difference, you know, we are lagging with respect to uh, the other uh, comparable country, but it's an opportunity. And if they succeed in increasing uh, the participation of those persons, you know, to the economy, there could be, uh, you know, there could be, uh, um, um, you know, additional resources to finance uh, not only the social protection, but also uh, the economy in general and the various investments that you should do, uh, like um, think about uh, uh, transition, uh, energy transition, uh, ecological transition or, uh, or education, for instance, a massive investment are needed. So does that mean that you're in favor of the pension reform? We know it's been a very problematic issue in the first mandate of Emmanuel Macron. They want to bring it back. Obviously, it has to be in a different way uh, because you say senior employees could be a very important element to uh, revitalize so that extent the, the job market in France. Then is the pension reform one of the elements of this? Yes, of course, but it should not be uh, done alone. You know, if you like uh, increase the age at uh, retirement, you know, without any other measure like a training of all the worker like fighting against uh, discrimination and so on and so on then it could be a, a bit complicated you know by uh, because by moving up you know the age at which uh, you do go to retirement actually you create you know more employment on one hand but also more unemployment you know some some of those people you know get uh, uh, get kicked out you know of the labor market because of their uh, because uh, of their qualification which is not uh, adequate you know to what uh, is uh, demanded uh,